Yo. Back again with another My Team video. And at this point, I don't know what is worse. My 250k law still, like, fighting me or the content in this game personally i don't i don't know which one is worse like i, I just i just i don't know what they're doing with my team at this stage I, I don't know no more personally they're adding in the the insert cards because these packs ain't even all that like fun i mean first off you look at shaquille o'neal today in Dark Matter, Shaq is just so on. He's going for 600k. 600k. And this card is underwhelming as heck. Like, Shaquille O'Neal is not better than Porzingis. Not better than D-Rob. And he's going for 600,000 MT. Freaking mad. I just, I just, I just, I just don't get my team. And then they got this car. Like, I want, like, I mean, like, what did they even drop that was so good? I mean, Brandon, Lonzo, how much is Lonzo going for? I mean, Lonzo is just going to play, like, magic. I mean, how much is Lonzo ball even? 400. What are these odds, bro? You got Alonzo going for 400k. You got Magic going for... Not Magic. Shaq for 600k. How many Shaqs are even on the market at this stage? Like, I mean... I mean, barely that many up. Like, you can tell. So, a lot of people just aren't opening. Either the odds are complete garbage. Or... People just aren't opening these packs. Like... There's just no reason to open these packs, literally. Like, Shaq doesn't even have a shooting badge, which is just... Uh, just nuts. Like, he don't even have a shooting badge. Like, it, it, it's just... I, I don't know really what they're doing. I really don't know what they're doing with my team at this point. And let's check, uh... Like, this pink diamond, I've been trying to snipe him for an hour... And he hasn't popped up at all. Jonathan Pink a Diamond. I, I've been searching for an hour. And this card has not popped up. Like, they obviously manipulate the odds. To where people just aren't pulling them. Because literally, it has to be the case. It has to be the case. Because literally, I have searched for an hour. And I have not seen this card one time on the filter not once bro and i'm not paying full price like i will search until i see this card for a snipe like i will i will search until i see this card but until until i like see this card i i will i will i will search this whole week and if i got to i will snipe this card Bucket guarantee it. I am gonna snipe this car. Ten thousand percent. You're gonna see it in this snipe video on Sunday. I am gonna snipe this freaking car, and I am gonna make some nice MT about it. But yeah, I mean, this content drop today is so mid. Just I don't know. Like this game has just not been. At least Evan Mobley went down. He was 100k earlier. Like, earlier today I saw that. But I really just don't know what they're doing with my team at this point. I just don't know. I'm not even going to try some different, con like, 2k content tomorrow. But, man, my team has just been so hard to boot up. Like, when they're doing stuff like this, I mean, the gameplay sucks. At least, like, all for good content. Good lord. I just don't understand this game. Why drop Tracy McGrady, then drop Kobe Bryant? Why drop Yao Ming like two months ago, then give us Shaquille O'Neal that can't even hold a shooting badge and just is so mediocre? I just don't, I just, I just, I just don't get it. Like, I'm so personally lost. 
I just don't know what they're truly doing with my team at this stage. Like, Shaquille O'Neal is basically an upgrade of his Opal, just with a little bit of a three-pointer now. Like, that is, like, the only difference between Opal Shaq. Like, just in the fact that maybe he can handle the ball better. This, that's really about it. Like, Shaq's literally one of the worst Opals in the game. Just, it's just it is what it is. I mean... I just don't get how you drop Porzingis, David Robinson, Taco Fall, and then expect us to get hyped about a Shaq card. Or you have Lonzo. You drop Lonzo, which is very quick. I mean, it's nice and cool, but like Ben Simmons and Magic already exist. You just dropped like 100 out of position point guards last week. You just dropped Jimmy Butler last week. Like, that people would rather use over Lonzo. Like, you just did this last week. So, it's just like... Eh, it's just kind of underwhelming. I just... I just... I just... I just... I just don't know. I just really don't... Scotty Barnes, like, 78k. I just don't know what they're truly doing with my team at this stage in the game, honestly. 300k, 500k. The market is so high because the odds are complete garbage. But, yeah, I just... I just I just don't know. Like, Bill Russell just came out recently. He can play small forward. I mean, they're better off just doing another out-of-position set, in all honesty, or dropping a Michael Jordan with T-Max jumper, like... I just, I just, I just don't know what we're doing here, like, with this. I mean, I know they had to add inserts. I mean, inserts also make it less chance of you pulling the card you want, so. And it's not even like the inserts give you better odds or anything, so. Yeah, it's just, I imagine it's Austin Rivers going for her, that he's really good, too. He's only 8k like dang for austin rivers i heard he's actually a really good pink diamond but yeah the pacing in my team has been garbage the gameplay sucks i just makes it really hard to enjoy my team right now and i kind of hope that changes i don't know how exactly they're gonna change that i mean i might just personally tomorrow just sell everybody on my team and just like run a budget squad like in all honesty like sell my juice stuff like Jokic, been just sell everybody and then just run a budget squad and just build my mt and just do that in all honesty because in all honesty to make my team more fun because what they doing and just like keep my MT until they do like invincible cards down the line or stuff of that nature because right now in my team it is just what they're doing is kind of just lame and just underwhelming so yeah I might just personally do that tomorrow I might just sell everybody and in tomorrow's video just put everyone on the auction house just build like a Tactical. Maybe I'll probably keep Taco. Maybe just build a budget squad and just rock out with that until they like drop better content. Cause right now it's kind of dull in my team. I'm just being honest. It's kind of. It's just. It's just. I just. I mean, the pink diamonds are going for 200k. I mean, they're manipulating the odds, making pink diamonds go for 2 million. I mean, the fact that I just searched for an hour on the filter and didn't even see a card on the filter should tell you everything was wrong with this game. And yeah, I mean, how much is Taco Fall even going for? I think the last time I checked, he was 300. I sniped him for 85k. 300k for Taco Fall. Yup. This is what's wrong with this game. I just, I just, I just, I just, I mean, I mean, we got Taco Fall at 300k. We got Pink Diamonds going for 300k. We got Shaquille O'Neal with mid-release. Then we got 
Kobe dropping, even though we have a Tracy McGrady that's way better. I just, like, why didn't you drop Kobe first, Shaq? I mean, I just don't understand the pacing in this game anymore. I just, I just, I just, I just whatever, man. My team is just in the gutter currently, and yeah, I'm just ranting about it, because is that a bad idea let me know in the comment section if i should just sell everybody and just see how much funds we get and just like rock out with a budget squad until then because yeah the way they're doing my team right now it's just not it is frustrating but like i said we push through it and yeah but let me know in the comment section. And yeah, but... Yeah, this drop freaking sucks. But see y'all the next of my team video. Hey,